and how to invoke our Lama. If our Lama is going to come back, how do we, what do we do to invoke our Lama's incarnation to come back? I will teach you. I'll explain to you. And that will help every center in the world. Okay? What makes our Lama come back? How do we make an incarnation come back? How do we find an incarnation? What's the procedures? I'll explain. And if the Lama has an incarnation, and what to do? Get him back, slap the kids left and right, pass it around the committee, now I'm going to get you. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't pass me to David. <laughs> don't. He'll molest me and then he'll beat me up. I know it. It'll be, I'm going to get you now. I'll be damaged, but I'll, be count I'll go to Gandhin for counseling. I was touched. <laughs> but did that person who touched you, did that uncle who touched you want to touch you? No, they touched me just to put me down for revenge. I was touched and I need help. <laughs> and can you, can you confront your, your toucher? I'll try. Look at a picture of David. Ah. <laughs> oh, money, Pemei Hong. Ah. And that's right. And then after David gets his hand all over me and beats me up and slaps me, guess who they pass me to next? Crystal. <laughs> no, you're gonna get it! No, you're gonna get it! Make me say with my foot! <laughs> You want to go back to Gandhi Monastery, do you? Recite 10 million Mitzamas now! <laughs> Couldn't you see little innocent Rinpoche, all cute and big starry eye, like... <laughs> <laughs> then after Crystal finishes with me, they'll pass me to Wai Ming, but it's just for a minute. The minute pass to Wai Ming, I come out of his room, I'm wearing his glasses. <laughs> That'll teach you to talk behind my glasses, you monster! <laughs> now try to get me back. And little, in, little Rinpoche got black and blue marks with his mala reciting Mixama, who was touched by David and with Wyming's glasses. <laughs> Can you believe it? And then, and then they pass me over to Joy. And when they pass me over to Joy, guess what? Justin does up my hair, I come out with a reggae look. <laughs> with his glasses, with my mala, and touched. <laughs> Can you imagine little three-year-old Rimichi with reggae hair? What's your name? I'm Bob Marley. <laughs> <laughs> and then after Justin finishes me with my new hairdo, three-year-old incarnation with the reggae Bob Marley look, they pass me over to Andy. <laughs> you want to hear a story, Rimichi? <laughs> Rimichi would be his hair glass like, Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah uh -huh. mm -hmm. oh my god. And after Andy, but Rimichi's smart, he brought his earplugs along. <laughs> Is that earplugs you're wearing? Oh, oh. No. Then after they finish me off with Andy, guess what? Oh my god. They passed me over to Auntie Millie. and then they never see me ever again. <laughs> Millie explained me to death, and I willed myself to take another incarnation. <laughs> they found my body. <laughs> they found my body by Amcock Mall. You know Amcock Mall? They're the lake they're thrown into. <laughs> oh my god. And my new incarnation comes back. And when my new incarnation comes back, you know, it's three years again, pass me over to Mr. Ngao. He gives me a brand new haircut. It's got hair here, nothing here. I'm like, jeez, <laughs> all this revenge taxes. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? And then after Mr. Mouse finished me, I got this brand new haircut. Not more Bar Marley, thank you very much. I look like Groucho Marx now. They passed me over to Irene. <laughs> now, Rinpoche. Chang. Bless everything in this room so I can sell it to build your center now. Bless it, Rinpoche! 
I'll be, I'll be, I'll be blue. <laughs> I mean, be selling it. three million for that, <laughs> two million for that, nine hundred and eighty-eight thousand for that, one hundred eighty-eight thousand for that, and Rimbachi's in the other room. <laughs> and then she ran out of things for me to bless, so she put me. She gave me a balloon. <laughs> this is Irene running in the other room. <laughs> <laughs> That's. What happens if Rinpoche comes back? I know you guys are gonna get me. I know it. I just look at all your evil little beady eyes going, come back, Rinpoche. Reincarnate back for the sake of all sentient beings. Come back. We love you. And Rinpoche's, Rinpoche's like floating about his mother thinking, he's like, maybe it's a trick. And he looks down at Kitchara House, all of you, then, oh, money, pen, 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 oh, money. Then Rinpoche uses his astral body to gauge, oh, money, pen, oh, And Bill Keefe was very nice. He wrote a note, don't let them fool you. They're going to get you. <laughs> you see, I haven't done anything to torture Bill Keefe yet. So he writes a little note. So I'm in my astral body floating, you know. And looking at my mother and thinking, should I enter her beautiful body and womb and take rebirth and benefit all sentient beings? And everybody, I'm looking at Kichara House, everybody's like, oh, come back, come back. Oh, Mani, pay me home. Oh, Mani, pay me home. Oh, Rimachi, oh, Mani, pay me home. Oh, oh Mani, pay me home. Come back. And they're thinking, he's like, come back, come back. And then, and then Paul and Wendy and Jivan Rajaswari, they're all in protector Cetro's room. Oh, my, 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 come back, come back, come back. And the only nice person is Bill saying, don't come back, they're gonna get you. They're gonna get you. <laughs> and then guess what? Guess what? Bonita catches Bill. <laughs> What's that piece of paper you're holding? <laughs> and Bill's like, <laughs> nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. <laughs> and Rinpoche's like, like, hmm. There's 300 of them say, come back, and there's one with that note, hmm. <laughs> nah, Bill must be insane. <laughs> <laughs> and the minute I come out, can you imagine? The minute little Rinpoche comes out, the minute little Rinpoche comes out, can you just see it? Can you just see her? Girlie would be like, Do you want some milk? <laughs> Drink! <laughs> so I'm like, That's enough! You're gonna get fat! <laughs> Did you poop again? <laughs> and I'm like, So that incarnation wheels itself out and it comes back again. And this time it's born in Japan. Thank you. <laughs> and then when you come and say, oh, Rimichi, you put three Tara statues out. You put three stupas here. Say, pitch yours. And that was mine. That's mine. I go, oh, it must be that one. Hmm. No, that's the wrong one. Oh, let me see. It must be that one. You failed the test. Oh, well, I don't go to go, get to go to Malaysia. I'll have my last laugh. You'll see. I'll have my last laugh. <laughs>